Question four. Sophia de designs jewellery and she's working on a design for a bracelet. And each link on the bracelet uses a, a length of silver. So you can see the length of silver. When you've got one link, you can see that she's joined together one, two, three, four, five, six, six lengths of silver. And then for two links, you can have 10 lengths of silver. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. How many lengths of, of silver are needed for three links of the bracelet? Well, to go from one link to two links, the length of silver needed was an extra four. So to get from three li two links to three links, you'd add another four lengths of silver. So 10 plus four is 14 links. So 14 is the answer that I'm going to circle. Sophia thinks that she needs six lengths of silver for each extra link and explain why Sophia is not correct. So what they're expecting to see there is if you look at it, we can see it's going up in fours. And the reason it's going up in fours is that this front piece here is the last, is the piece, is two um, lengths of silver from the previous piece. So you could just say, because the pattern goes up in fours, Or that two lengths are from the previous link. Anything that explains that. And the last bit, part C. Sophia uses 50 lengths of silver to make a bracelet. How many links are there in the bracelet? Well, we know the rule is that it goes up in fours. And the first link has six in it. So if we say that there are 50 lengths, minus the first link, which is six. So that means there's 44 lengths. Now we know those extra lengths are going to be, uh, extra links are going to be extra an extra four. So if we divide by four, then we get 11. So that means we've got 11 links plus the first link. So in total, there are 12 links on this bracelet. 